to Eagle Ridge, Ridge News. News. I'm Reagan. And I'm Kylie. Today we have our top interviewers on the scene. First up, we have Lindsay interviewing the yearbook committee. Cut to you, Lindsay. Hello, my name is Lindsay from Eagle Ridge News. We're here with Miss Nofsker. <laughs> We're going to ask you a couple questions about the yearbook committee. Okay. How did you get the idea of creating the yearbook committee? Since the yearbook is for the students and not for me, I thought it would be best if I would hire staff to design your yearbook. I'm an adult. I don't necessarily like the same things that you guys like, so I figured that would be the best way to represent um, what happened in your middle school years is if you guys worked on it together. Um, uh, how do you... Call how do you set up like your the yearbook like from front cover to the inner pages? So we have two different kind of systems that work together. We use what's called a page ladder, and it's not hanging up yet. But that's how you break down um, what pages you want certain activities. So you either have your mug shots; those are the pictures that you have on your IDs, mm -hmm. or activity pictures, um, groups and clubs, and so they'll be marked out and are software is all internet based so we have like one piece of paper and everything else is done online mm -hmm. um how do you qualify to be in your book committee well everybody qualifies um we run it kind of like a business so you have to fill out an application and then the students come in and they're interviewed and um it helps i feel it helps the students for what they're going to be doing in their future we also run it like a business um, I'm just the overseer. The students run each other. They have different jobs. Um, yes. Um, are you looking for new people? We are always looking for new people. I have students that are in different activities and clubs, and so I wanted them not to feel like they had to commit to just one. So, or we have kids that are in sports, and so they'll be out a certain time. So we are always taking applications and doing interviews to kind of keep the spots filled and allow kids to come join us. Last question, um, what are you, what, is there like a sneak peek you can give us for oh. what you're planning for this year's yearbook? What do you think guys? No. no. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. I'm Lindsay from Eagle Ridge News and thank you for your time. Thank you. Lainey Ross, co-editor. Maya Trahill, co-editor. Juliana Nahad, computer technician. Uh, Madison Bourne, photographer. Ayana Garcia, designer. Victoria, designer. Dylan Vias, advertiser. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Thank you, Lindsay. And thank you to the yearbook and Miss Snofsker for letting us interview them. Next up, we cut to Maddie interviewing Mr. Romero in the gym. Hi, I'm Maddie here from Eagle Ridge News. Today I'm in the gym with the basketball coach, Mr. Romero. Uh, Mr. Romero, I have a couple questions. Uh, when do tryouts start for this year? This upcoming season tryouts will begin on November 19th. Um, since this season hasn't really kicked up yet, I'm going to ask you some questions about last season. Okay. Um, how was last season for you? Last season being my first year here at Eagle Ridge was a little challenging, um, but getting the boys to buy into our system and what we are trying to accomplish with the basketball team was actually very successful. Um, how did last... Um, how was your team last season? Um, like typical middle schoolers, we had some positives and negatives. Um, but again, getting them to buy into what we're trying to teach them in the game of basketball and in life was the challenging part. But overall, it turned out really great. What was your biggest accomp accomplishment of last season? I would have to say that last season, a lot of people doubted us. We had some rough games. Um, but overall, we came in fourth place in the end of the season tournament. So going from losing to Actually, getting fourth place was actually the greatest accomplishment we had. Thank you for your time, Mr. Romero. You're welcome. I'm Maddie here in the gym with Mr. Romero. Thank you, Maddie, and good luck to the people trying out. Now we go to Kylie interviewing Coach Cassie. Hello, I'm Kylie, and this is Eagle Ridge News. I'm going to be interviewing Coach Cassie. Um, she is the cheer coach for our school. So how long have you been coaching the team? I've been coaching this team for three years but I've been coaching 12 years all together. Ooh, how is the season looking so far? So far, we're gonna put some amazing stuff out there that we haven't tried before, so it'll be a great year. Ooh, and how's that stuff looking? It's 
looking great. I'm super excited. So how was last season? Last season we were undefeated and that's the goal this year. <laughs> um, and I know these girls put in a lot of hard work and dedication. How long would you say you practice a week? We practice about seven hours a day. Or seven hours a week. <laughs> and when does the season start? The season starts in August and then we end in May. So we go full year. That's awesome. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you. I'm Kylie and this was Eagle Ridge News. Thank you. Thank you guys for watching and have an amazing break. We'll be back in a few weeks. Don't forget, we're gone on the 21st through the 23rd for Thanksgiving break. Eat your turkey, kids. And be sure to come to the Winter Ball December 7th. <laughs> Signing out for now. Have a great Thanksgiving. And we are here with Eagle Ridge News. I'm Kylie. And I'm Regan. Bye. Thank, Thank you for watching Eagle Ridge News. News.